So we are down in Fort Lauderdale, Florida, where I am doing my training camp down here at Hard Knocks 365 and training with all these guys and getting after it. Once again, putting my calling over my comfort, away from the family, down here by myself in some, some stranger's house, in some stranger's bed, living the lonely life, but it's all worth it on fight night when you get your hand raised and you know all the hard work and sacrifice that you put in was realized and it turned into a victory. I think the best expectations you can have in this sport is to have no expectations whatsoever. You know, I've trained for the last 10 years and have had numerous opponents switch up, whether it's the week before the fight, eight weeks before the fight, six weeks before the fight, they push the fight back. You never quite know really what's going to happen. You're at the mercy of your opponent. You're at, you're at the mercy of your opponent's health or win willingness to fight. You're at the mercy of the promoter, what they want to do if they want to push you onto a different card or keep you on the same card, find you a new opponent. And you just realize that as much as you try to be in control, all you can really be in control of is your own training your own self, your own mental state, your own physical state, your own spiritual state, and then just hope for the best. Three and a half, four weeks before the fight, we get a phone call saying uh, my opponent is hurt. So the next day I'm training and sparring like I'm going to fight Patricio Pitbull who said that he was going to fight me. Chose my partners based on that. Chose my game plan for that sparring session based on that. Um, was in that mental state that I was going to fight Patricio Pitbull. Then six hours later after sparring I'm home and I'm hanging out. Manager calls me and says he's not going to sign the bout agreement so now we have a different opponent. Southpaw, different style, completely different um, kind of completely different kind of animal that we're fighting, you know. So the, what you realize is you just have to focus mainly on yourself, focus on my strengths, my abilities, my gifts, and how I'm going to put myself in the best situation possible to be successful in a fight, whether I'm fighting anybody in the entire world, you know. So you just have to be ready. You have to be prepared. Um, and really just focus on yourself and how you can, what's gonna put you in the best possible scenario and the easiest path to victory no matter who you fight in the entire world because you can have a, an opponent switch up literally the day before the fight and there's nothing you can do about it. You have to step into the cage, bite down on your mouthpiece and fight.